Is this working? All right, let's go for a ride. Let's go for a ride. What's up, y'all? Take a love. We'll take a love to you. you know, I keep getting these clips sent to me. And it's, this shit is just fucking embarrassing. It's fucking embarrassing. This dude, Nags, you're making videos saying shit the exact opposite of things that you were saying before. The complete and exact opposite. Now, when I came to you after I was talking to Alex, what was that, like eight months ago or something like that? It wasn't even that, maybe it wasn't even that long ago. I was like, look, it, there's, there's a bunch of shit they have on... Uh, Yaba and Sam, they have some shit that they can uh, get over to you. And he was like, oh yeah, give me that shit. I'll stream about that shit. You wanted to make money off of it. We had this conversation that you wanted to make money off of this information. At the same time too, you were saying everything was water under the bridge with Alex and Callie. But now, I mean, you're a fraud. You're a phony. You you stand for nothing. You're you're fucking bitch made, bro. And uh, just keep at it. See what happens. I guarantee I'll make it so every noise that you don't recognize, every footstep that you don't recognize, every knock, every creak, you'll be so paranoid. You'll be tearing out whatever hair starts starts sprouting on top of your fucking bald weirdo head looking like fucking powder on crack I mean you gotta knock this shit off bro you're fucking embarrassing I mean I tried to be cool with you I didn't want to you know go you know jump in on the dog pile that's already happening it's gonna continue to happen it's never gonna stop at this point now because you're such an embarrassment but um yeah I mean I came to you in DMs you wanted all the the information that that Alex had, you wanted every single receipt she ever had, you wanted everything, and you thought at the same time too that they were going to help take down Yaba and Sam's channel, all your enemy, all the all your other enemies' channels, because you, in your heart of hearts, still really think that Callie played a big role in taking down your YouTube channel. I just want you to realize, bro, that the only people that can take down their channel is the creator themselves. Yes, people can start up you know, flagging campaigns and all this other shit. Hard alarm. It won't matter, you know, at the end of the day, if you don't do anything to break the, the, the terms of service. So you came to me in DMs, you wanted to go to bat for them. You thought there was going to be some money in for, you know, in it for you you didn't make any money out of it and i don't know what you're doing now because you've you've gone into a complete circle attacking everyone over the years and there's no one left for you to white knight for in this drama space where you think that you're going to pick up new supporters uh that you're going to get money out of this shit you've gone after everyone at this point so anything and there's there's, there's no new information you were just sticking up for Kelly, going after Shane. There's been no new information that has been released since you started going, you know, after Shane. And now you're trying to flip the script and go after Callie and Alex. You didn't have her docs. You did not have her docs. Because I remember, because I was a part of the people that were trying to find her docs. We had it wrong. It was completely wrong. It was a different person. We had the person's picture, their Facebook. It was a fucking totally different person. You never had the doc. So stop trying to claim that you did because you didn't. We all know where the docs came from. Alex knows where the docs came from. She gave it to somebody in confidence. She told somebody uh, her name um, in confidence. And they ran to Sam and Yaba and Sam doxed her out. That's what happened. Stop for Looney Tunes. You need to go on back on your psych meds because you were you were prescribed antipsychotic and you should be on that. And all this paranoia and all these strange things that you think are, are happening around you will stop. All these delusions of grandeur, you thinking that you're a rock star, going to be a millionaire in a few years, all this shit, that shit will just stop and cease. I'm really not trying to jump on this 
dog pile, but if you keep at it, I'm going to. You saw what happened to uh, Greg, Gregory Phillip. You got people out here like Cliffy the Pred acting like, like that on uh, Facebook. There was a sock account Facebook from 20 years ago that was made up and changed to his name. The Facebook was around for like 20 years, bro. 15 years, whatever the fuck it was. It was, in, it was inactive for 12 years, you dipshit. You keep saying such stupid things. This is going to make it better when we release everything eventually. We just keep collecting on you fucking weirdos. I mean, my God. Well, I'm going to... It's a, it's a bad look. Why we ever try to help you. You came to us for help. And we should have never helped you because you're fucking unstable. And what's up, chat? Sorry to go off. But uh, I just wanted this to be said. Leave Alex alone. Leave Callie alone. If you don't leave them alone, <laughs> you just gotta, there's just going to be problems for you, bro. There just there really is. And you could stream inside of a store that's inside of another store that's inside of a fucking closet, a bathroom inside of a closet. And I guarantee you, every time you bring up their names, you'll be trembling. I guarantee it. Every every footstep, every sound that sounds, you know, that that sound that doesn't sound ordinary to you, you're gonna lose your goddamn mind. So keep at it, bro, and see what happens. Cause you're fucking with the wrong people, dude. You're fucking with my friends, and I don't appreciate it. You're a user, you're an abuser, and that's just let's just be, you know, clear and simple to it. You're a loser. You're a fucking loser. You keep pushing back that store, that storefront opening, because you know you're gonna, you're gonna fucking, it's gonna fail. I mean, I've never seen a place look look like such utter shit. You got these weird ass hats, no, that nobody's ever gonna buy. It looks like a like a retarded Christmas tree. When I saw the, your hat rack, it reminded me of like a, a family of tards that put together a tree and made a retarded tree, a retarded Christmas tree. Is that gonna be your tar tree for Christmas, buddy? Fucking dipshit. Merry Christmas and Happy Hanukkah, asshole. <laughs> this fucking loser. He's not gonna like what's coming next. Oh my God.